Hey guys, Pastor Tim here with our next memory verse for Lighthouse Baptist Church, Psalm 105, verse 1. Psalm 105, verse 1 says, Oh, give thanks unto the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the people. Now, this is an obvious verse when it comes to November because we have Thanksgiving. And I'm very thankful for November because that's when all the pumpkin stuff starts coming out. You got your pumpkin pie, pumpkin bread, maybe in a pumpkin spice latte too, who knows. But anyway, the focus of America starts to shift to being thankful. What are you thankful for? And I think uh, this is something that's very important, especially when it comes to the child of God. I think it's very important that we have an attitude of gratitude, being thankful for the things that we are blessed with. Because that, because when you have that thankful spirit, it takes the focus off of yourself and onto someone else. And most importantly, the things we can be most thankful for are for what God has done for us. Make known his deeds among the people. Think about that for a second. What has God done for you? And don't just thank God for that, but tell other people about it as well. So let's think about that for a second. Oh, give thanks unto the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the people. What is the greatest thing Christ has done for you as the child of God? Well, he has died for your sins. Not only should we be thankful of that and live in light of that thought each and every day of our lives, but we should make that known unto the people around us as well. Hey, guess what my Savior did for me and guess what he did for you? Tell somebody about your great God. Tell them why you're thankful for what Christ has done for you and tell them why you're thankful that you're a Christian. And I think Lighthouse Baptist Church, if we just not only memorize this verse, but meditate upon it, take it to heart, we can have a great impact on our community this November. And don't just stop there. Don't just be thankful in one month or one day when you have your turkey and stuffing and so forth. No, take that attitude of gratitude, that thankful spirit, and continue it on throughout the coming months into the next year, into 2021. And whether you want to believe it or not, you can be thankful for things that even happened in 2020 as well. I know it's been a hectic year, but there are things that have happened. God is still faithful. He has blessed us in many great ways. Thank him for that and tell other people why you're thankful for what God has done for you. So once again, that verse is Psalm 105 verse 1. Oh, give thanks unto the Lord. Call upon his name. Make known his deeds among the people.